Hey guys, welcome back to the fish tank here, sitting with Cody Overbeck. Cody, welcome to Bridgeport. Thank you. Uh, what did you feel was Bridgeport the best fit for you for this 2014 season? Uh, well, they were the first ones to call me after I got released. I really didn't uh, have a choice, I guess. But you know, now that I'm here, I seem to like it. So I'm glad I chose Bridgeport. Have you heard of the Atlantic League? Oh, uh, yeah. When yeah. you so what? What's your overall impression of? You know, what to expect in this league? Uh, you know, there's a lot of good players. Um, I didn't really know what to get until I got here or started putting up rosters a few, years, uh, a few weeks ago. But um, a lot of good players that I played with or against in the past. So uh, you know, I'm excited to be here. All right. Now you've spent a lot of time in the Philadelphia Phillies organization. Um, what were some of those experiences that you learned playing with those guys that you hope to carry forward here with Bridgeport? Um, I don't, I don't know. Let's, let's cut that part out. I don't know. All right. Yeah, Sorry. We'll, we'll cut that part out. That's fine. All right. All right. You're someone that likes the long ball. Hit okay. a lot of homers. Um, in fact, you've never failed to finish the season below double digits. You know, what's the secret to being a power hitter? <laughs> I don't know if there's a secret. Um, I, don't, I don't know. Just, just, if you try to hit a homer every time, you're eventually going to hit some. I mean, that's kind of what I do. But, uh, you know, I just... You know, hopefully you can just, I, I don't know. I don't, I don't think there is a secret. Um, being in a league like the Atlantic League, it's a pretty hitter-friendly league. Good, good. Is that, uh, you know, something that you're going to look forward to now? Oh, I didn't know that till now, but I am I am from now. I will. Good. Now, you've played a lot of ballparks, a lot of stadiums, and minor leagues, and the independent leagues. A lot of crazy things that happen out in the field, promotions or something along those lines. What's one thing that maybe stuck in your mind that you remember that made you laugh a little bit? Or... Uh, there's been a few of them. Uh, a couple of years ago, there was a guy that brought these dogs and they would have monkeys ride them. They would herd goats or something in the outfield. Oh, really? Yeah, that was pretty interesting. And then uh, one time there was a mascot on a four-wheeler and flipped it during the thing. And it was, it was going pretty fast. So that was pretty funny, too. Uh, those, those are a few things that stuck out. All right, now, you know, and then going along with that a little bit in a separate direction. Since you played in with so many teams and leagues, you know, what's one thing that you've learned from yourself over the years that you, know, that you like to go, keep going forward? You know, just anything from playing previously. Um, I've had a lot of fun, you know, and I really, I really enjoy the lifestyle that I've got to live the past few years. And, you know, that's one of the main reasons that I want to keep playing is just because I, I enjoy doing it and I enjoy the joy of life. Now, 2014, what are some of your hopes and goals, not only for yourself, but for this team? Uh, you know, we want to win. And, uh, you know, I think my goal, along with, I'm assuming everybody else's goal, is to get picked up by a, you know, a different team. Um, you know, I think that's what everybody's here for, and that's what I'm trying to do. All right, well, Cody, good luck this season. Thanks Thank for you. sitting with us. He's Cody Overbeck. I'm JJ Duke. We'll see you next time here on the Fish Tank.